Yo, 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 what's going on, guys? It's your boy Sanjay back at it with another YouTube video. Today, we're going to be reacting to Warzone players. People, I'm just going to let myself die and I'm just going to spectate people killing me and I'm going to react to it. And that's basically what we are going to do today. So, if you enjoy the video, please leave a like and subscribe and, uh, you know, just enjoy the video. Naruto Senpai. Okay, let's see how this goes. <laughs> right, he's got 2.9 bags. He's running away. I don't know what his objective is. His thing is, I haven't played Bonansk in ages, so. But I have played Verdansk, and by the way I see, he's kind of running outside of the zone. Like, the complete other direction. He's seen the car <laughs> and run away from it. Dude, what is this kid doing, bro? <laughs> oh, man. Oh, it's threat. Oh, I think the guy in the car is hunting him. <clears throat> Man's been watching enough, well, almost too much Jason Bourne. Doing those zigzags, you know. It's good, though. I like the strats. Someone's been uh, murdered right where he is now. I guess he's like like to be like a you know a bush soldier or a mountain camper because he's running to the very edge of the map. It seems like he's playing it stealthy. Okay, playing it stealthy, which is you know, come see, come sir. Yeah, bro, man almost got his head bucked off, <laughs> which is not so Gucci. He's got a little ATV to protect him if he needs to get away, but. I don't know what this guy is doing, bro. The thing is, is like, I find Verdansk has an idea. Nice, you know, it's, it's really crispy, it's really juicy. There's a car following him, bro. That's Is that his bounty? That, uh, bro, the car in front of him is his bounty. He's gonna get caught. How does he know he's there? No, he doesn't. Uh oh. He's gonna die. Shoot. <laughs> no way. <laughs> he got beat. Oh, what a nerd. Unlucky Naruto Senpai. Better luck next time, homie. Olympic boys, let's go. So now we have Olympic boys coming up. Getting beamed. Six kills. Ooh, 13.8 bags. I don't know if he has a custom loadout. Six kills, 61 people left. Nah, this, okay, savage like chasing, I guess. Throwing a trophy in the car so he can get away. Hopefully without getting sniped in the face. He's also being hunted, so the hunter is being hunted. Yep, that's how it is. He's gonna go get that free loadout. I don't think he has a loadout. I think that's just default ground loot. Uh, he's very open, but you know, I don't know. He's just—he's a bit of a rebel. Doesn't really care, you know. Oh, bro, bro, he got his head bucked off as well. <laughs> All right, so he's dead. Who are we spectating now? These guys, these guys are like average players. They're good, not that sweaty, I don't think. This guy's okay. We're watching Cronlers. Is that like Greek or something? Cron Cronals, Cronlers, with a no stock AK. Interesting. Driving backwards, so he's got some key strats going on. I'm gonna go to zone. I don't know if he's doing because he doesn't want to get sniped, or he's doing it because he just. He just Finds it fun. 10k. Oh shit, bro. He's getting piped. He's been sniped as well, bro. Three people in the space of five minutes. I mean, their head bucked off. This is, bro. Chat, this is mayhem. This is absolute chaos, mate. Who are we spectating now? I don't know if he's in the ghoulie. We've got El Loco Luis. Hola, como estas, jefe? Problemas con las drogas. Donde esta la marijuana? We got El Loco Luis. On the mic right now, chat. Rocking him with four kills. Right, it's it's a dog out. It is a dog eat dog world out here. That's just how it is in the dance. All right, chat. That's just how it is. Does a little fast and furious little, you know, trick. Woo! Fast driver. Bit of a menace to society, as you can tell. And he's driving. When did they add the little side windows on the car? That is a really nice design. I can't lie. So he's running. Is that- that is a cost- Okay. <laughs> what is he trying to do? Oh, he's trying to- 
Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, sorry, Louise. Mr. Parkour. Hardcore parkour. Alright, so he's got a custom PPSH. Uh, we can't go third person, so I don't know where secondary is. Two stuns, two thermites. Decent. Max ammo. Satchel, gas mask. $200. Not so good, but he does have a self res. So he's in a good position right now. He's going for the high ground, so I'm assuming he has a sniper as a secondary. I'm assuming he wants to play this safe as well. Go for the dub, you know. Four kills. You know, it's, it's, it's an okay game. It's not amazing, but for some, that's good. And there's no judgment out here. He's got a sniper like I thought. Uh, I think that's a right tech I want to... No, wait, no, that's that Cold War one, isn't it? Bro, I don't even know the name of it, but this looks like a proper military sniper chat. What? <laughs> okay, we've got some proper, you know, army tactics going on. He's scouting the perimeter, looking around. He's literally... Watching the buy station for someone to go buy something. So hopefully well, we'll see who the next culprit is right Chat if I'm honest, this is a really actually a lot more interesting than I thought it would be I thought this would be like like fun, but quite lame seeing people play But it's actually really amusing to see how they you know how they psychologically tick He's aiming out with his PPSH who doesn't have that little sniper glare showing out unless he has the concealment attachment I'm, I'm not too sure uh, I'm not too sure. Repositioning. My man Louise likes a bit of nature. He likes the nature walks, you know, the birds tweeting in his ears, the sound of the, 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 the mud under his under his combat boots. It's a buy station in front of him, which I can't lie, I did not know even existed. Um, yeah, as I was saying before, I have no idea. I, I, I liked Vedansk at the start, but then Rebirth came out, and I just love Rebirth more now. Because Verdansk is just so long, bro. And like you've seen, I mean, three people in the space of five minutes got their head bucked off. Just, like, imagine they spend that time getting a loadout and shit, sweating, and, and now they're dead. You know, back to the loading screen it is. Back for another round, and it's just... It's a bit long. It's a bit long. But we're watching El Loco Louise out here. It does actually sound really nice. I can't lie, chat. The sound of the birds in the game is actually really nice. It's really tranquil, you know? I just sit in the hills the whole game, bro. Just like enjoy the sound of the birds, you know what I'm saying? I'm not quite sure who he's marking. I don't know if, if, if it means he wants to run there or if he knows that zone's gonna close Setting there or something, but court. you know, we'll see what happens. We'll see how it unravels, chat. You know, that's just all it. You gotta give these players a time and space they need, right? Got them to develop in their own ways, you know? I want a flapjack and a good ab jamming. No, <laughs> I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about, chat. Uh oh. Uh oh. And. <laughs> oh, look, Louise has been beaten to death, chat. Unlucky, bro. Unlucky. You did well, but the only thing I wouldn't have done there is run out in the open. Just like that. Okay, we got Paz Amit back at it. Five kills, 22 left. Using a car, Cold War 25, which is quite the meta right now. Uh, getting sniped at from behind. I don't know if he's gonna if he's gonna challenge it. Guess we'll find out in the next episode. He's gonna switch to a Bertha, which is probably a better idea because that car is so vulnerable. He does have someone's skin on it, which means someone is around or has been around. And that, yeah, that's right. Up there, he's got an XM4. Ooh. Okay, Pazami. Oh, he's getting. So there's someone trying to fight the guy in the tower, but I don't know if he knows that Paz Amit, our boy out here, is there. So we'll see how he plays this out. 3.8 bag, self-revive. That's what I'm saying. Look, he, the guy in the tower, he got beamed. Beamed viciously. And then it's game over. He's getting sniped out, but that's not phasing. That's that's not that's not pressuring Paz Amit. He's getting shot, he's right there. Nice head glitch, well played. Getting rid of the thermite already. Not such a good throw, if I'm honest, but you know there's room for improvement. Oh, he gets down! Bro, that's unfortunate. I can't lie, chat. The only reason why he got down is because his aim was a bit shoddy. Other than that, if he kept the glitch, he would have won that. But this is a very eventful game. A very eventful chat. We have Yumus Summers from Asla out here. Car 98, EM2, wonderful camo on that, it's quite nice. Satchel, gas mask, no self-rest, but 18 bags. 
getting pushed by a flipping Bertha right now. My guy's using a riot shield. <laughs> he gets absolutely beamed. We got Felice Delias de la Saga, whatever his name is, bro. Bro, he's using a riot shield and gas grenades? Like, is that you, yeah? He gets the run over, bro. No way, this guy's a straight. Guy leaves because he can't handle the smoke. <laughs> Four kills from Felice de la Saga. Go check out his YouTube if you haven't already chat. He's getting sniped at though. I don't think he realizes though, which is quite strange. The guy's right in front of him to the left, he knows that. The guy's got to go zone as well, so he could play this to his advantage. There's no way, bro. Bro, <laughs> there's no way. How did he flip and lose that? Right, she would, and a gas grenade. But it's okay, mistakes were made, it always are. No way! El Loco Luis is back! Hola jefe! Bro, that's crazy. He really is loco. What? He made it back from the gulag, went back for his loot, and then proceeded to kill his killer. Driven my revenge right there. Okay, he's playing this safe, right? El Loco Luis wants this win, and he's not gonna stop at anything. Nothing is gonna stop him from getting this win chat nothing he knows there's someone in front of him because they just set off that cluster i would probably take the high ground but he thinks there's someone i don't know why what's he doing he's going for ghost why bro he's going up the little array tower i think it's called yep so he's got some good strats and he's he's actually in a really good position if i'm honest right now but if zone doesn't work in his favor I could be screwed. <laughs> Almost got his head blown off, but no, well, he did get his head blown off by a bloody sniper, mate. That is game over. Thank you for coming, Oloku. Louise, your squid game attempt is over. He got sniped by Muz with eight kills. Okay, bit of an improvement. Really cool skin, bro. I don't know what that is. Swiss car 98, Mac 10, loadout, plate box on the ready, and a self res. He's in a good position right now. He's the guy. What the? Okay, I'm sorry, but what was that, bro? Goes for the quick scope. Doesn't know what to do. Oh, hits a drop shot, but unluckily doesn't get the kill. What was this guy using? FFAR. We got MR with the bro. Yo, if I died to this kid, bro, I'd be so sorry. He's only he got only got two kills. Right, two Ross Clark kills, chat. Can't lie, that's not too good. Mm -mm, it's not. He's end zone though, he's playing for the win. He's playing safe and reserved, but he's playing for the win. And that, that's what matters in this Verdant scene. He's looking for the ammo, but I think he has enough. And if he doesn't, he'll probably camp some more to get it. <laughs> uh, he needs to move zone, but he's lying on the floor. I'm not really sure why. I don't know why he set that marker as well. I don't know why people set markers from themselves. It's it's kind of, kind of interesting to me, I can't lie. Four people left though. Tried to run around, but didn't exactly make it. He's sneaking up now. Doesn't seem to realize he's completely in the open, so sneaking won't really do anything. Runs up, runs up, runs up. Yeah, okay. He's... And he almost gets beamed. Gets lucky that there's a tree in front of him. But he's going to probably get held out of zone right now, chat. Let's see how he plays this out. Luckily, that guy has trash aim, bro. He could have got beamed, but didn't. He knows there's a guy in front of him. He knows there's a guy on top of him. Which one's going to take up first? Where's the last guy there? Zone is somewhat in his favor. Okay, MR is playing this like a proper camper, bro. 
a this is a diverse lobby. This this chat is a diverse lobby full of every type of player, bro. Okay. Oh. Uh, okay. Oh, uh, the rocks are not in his favor. And he's probably not gonna make it. He needs to get this kill so he can steal the guy's gas mask. But he's probably not gonna do it. He does do it. Steal the guy's gas mask. He did not really play that well, so he's been beam. Which we kind of could have predicted. He's got a self res though, but he's not gonna make that. No way he'll make that, bro. Yeah. Thanks for coming, Marv. Have a great day. Who are we spectating now? I LMAO from Easy M1D. Um, yeah. He's in zone nicely with five kills. One on one situation chat. EM2 with that sexy camo, which I don't know what it's called. One on one situation. Who's gonna win this? Who's even the other guy? I don't know. Mm. I would be so fucking pissed off if I died to that. PSY1 gets the win, chat. Gets the win. Shoots his dead body because he's a straight up savage. He does not care what's going on, cuz. He does not care. So, to conclude this wonderful game, the guy with the riot shield again. That's how it is. Simple as that. Chat, that was, a, that was a really diverse game, if I'm honest, because we had people who were tryharding, we had people who were sniping, we had people who were camping, we had people who were camping with riot shields, people who were pushing in the open. It's weird psychology of the game. Well, other than that, chat, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you very much for watching. This was... This was an interesting start. I think um, I think I'll definitely do this again because it's quite enjoyable. It's quite it's quite fun seeing how people play and the different the methods they take. It was just, it was just crazy to see it all unfold. You know, uh, it was quite unexpected, quite unpredictable. But that's what we like in a Call of Duty game. You know, leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed. Help me get on the YouTube algorithm. Share it with people if you feel like it. And I'll see you guys in the next video. It's your boy Sluggy Six Sanjay out. See you in a bit, yo.